It's an NHS and social care system under huge pressure from one end to the other. It's a problem backed up by the latest figures. The target for 95% of patients in A&D to be seen within four hours has never been met. But as we can see here, there's been a deterioration since the start of the pandemic. Last month's figure is the worst on record. Almost 11,000 had to wait longer than 12 hours, the highest number ever. And the latest ambulance response times were also the second worst on record. It's led the Royal College of Emergency Medicine to claim the NHS is broken. I don't think it's broken. I think we're managing to see around 200,000 people a month. That's not a broken system. There are still lots many, of people. Many, many people not being seen of in target there, times. Of course there are. People but, suffering. Of course there are. But the pressure on the system is immense. And that's why we need to make sure that we, we see less flowing into the system, more prevention. One of the big problems is that a lack of social care services means there are currently over a thousand patients stuck in hospital, unable to be discharged. Opening up the back doors of hospitals, releasing more people out into social care so that we can get to grips with the, with the problems at the front door. These are issues that we still have not seen Welsh Government taking proper action on.